Hello, 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 Gordon Gecko here once again, and this is my episode number 6 of uh, Conquering Central Asia here in Tajikistan. We are doing much better than uh, I was expecting in the first division, and we find ourselves uh, in the third place um, and still in the cup. First, let's look at the finances. Uh, we're continuing to go downhill. Um, actually, uh, the, it seems like a lost cause here. We are just um, in the beginning of the season, or you know, because the season here will last until uh, October, I think. Yeah, and we still have ninety-six thousand. Or the season will last until uh, June, and we still we are already ninety-six thousand below the the line. Having a lot of expenses, uh, not making money at all. Um, the board is very, uh, even though the, like this board here looks to give me uh, more coaching staff, more scouts, and now we have an affiliate club which is Kairakum. Uh, they are a team from the lower league. Uh, semi pro team, uh, so they are actually in the cup still with us. Um, what is also to know the confidence of the board is really high. Um, transfers 57% of um, 57 from finances are a little high. This is 67 is maybe because I'm not spending all this ridiculous amount of money in salary. Uh, 56 from matches, 57 from positions, plus that year. 80. So regarding the quote, I just added here this image of Pajakan. Um, um, and there's nothing else to see. We actually do a bit here in the value of uh, the company, and we are having now an attendance of 268 people on average. So pretty good. In terms of transfer history, um, only one guy, only if one guy came in on a loan. I really didn't want him. Uh, Spartak Moscow, I'll try, but I saw the name Spartak Moscow, so I just loaned this player. And, uh, I managed to free all of this, so all these guys, and actually a lot of uh, the expense came from putting all these guys to rest on a free transfer. So, Training wise, uh, now that we have the six coaches, we are doing much better here. Only strength is uh, slightly too low, as well as goalkeepers, since we don't have any goalkeeper um, things. Uh, we could have more scouts and more videos, but uh, I'm not sure we need those, to be honest. Okay, let's put the price. Um, this is also one of the things here on the, that I don't really understand. Average ticket price is even ticket. I don't really understand how FM does this stuff. But still, using the same tactic um, in the competitions, we are in the quarterfinals of the cup. Um, if you reach this, you'll get to the semis, and uh, that's the game that I'm showing you today. Um, if you look after the first game was that uh, I showed you with Israfshan, which you know we went on three consecutive wins without suffering goals and stopped for nil and against Fujian. Cup was probably the only one that I was really expecting that to be the case with us from second league. Then we lost to Regar in a game that we actually did better team. Uh yeah, here in C seventeen to five. Uh we won the first, oh, then we won against uh, Barki Tajik, the team that we're going to play today for the Cup, although this game was at home. We lost to Bash and in a game where they were the better team, but it was, it was some equilibrium in this game. In the first Cup game, if we won against Fahar from the lower leagues, we then had a huge game uh, at home against 
of some of the leaders at the moment of the league. Um, we were not the best team, uh, but we came down from 3-2 to make it 4-3, and then in the end, they scored um, on the last minute to make 4-4 four, four, and 5-4. Uh, we, we were, in this period, much, we are now much worse in defense, and we, we went for 3-2, and our fourth day, Palmyra went away. Um, 3-1 against Bufanda, uh, as we know the team in the third round of the, uh, the cup, and the 1-1 one, one draw, a very good result against Ikilo, uh in a game where they were slightly better, but only slightly, um, and it was a 1-1. One, one. Ikilo actually, they are doing, again, very well in the... International League or in the in the um, in the league or in the AFC Cup, they again uh, passed the group stages with. Well, we had seen this already. Like right? they passed in the group stages, right? This was already before. Yeah. Uh, so against Fiji, two wins, three 0 three one, and against the White. FC, they won the first game away 2 0, so they were probably going to win this next one at home. And they will go to the final uh, against either the Syrian team of Al Jaish or the Baya from um, probably against the Syrian, the Baya from Indonesia. Um, well, just before we go into this game, I just wanted to show you. Um, as a, as, a, as, a, as, a, as a as a a club or as a, a nation. Let's start actually for the end of 19. They have um, the 19 schedule. Last year they had uh, on the qualifiers losses. This is pretty bad qualifying. They had like the NPA friendly against the Philippines and against Myanmar. Uh, they lost also Yemen, they lost recently against India, and they don't have any training schedule for 2017. For the under 20s, uh, when they competed before the World Cup, uh, they didn't have any games, uh, official games. Um, last year, they went against Brunei, 4 0 and Afghanistan, 4 0. Lost to Kuwait and South Korea, so normal results. Here this year, they went against the Timor and uh, lost against. Um, the team of South Korea again by the same result for no. Uh, next year they don't next year they don't have anything. The two thousand the U thirteen there was this qualifying where they UFC qualifying I don't even know what this is. Uh, pictures and results overview yeah, I don't know. I don't know how this works here, but uh, they did a pretty poor job, or not a very poor job. They won against the Bhutan. Actually, good win here against South Side. Short loss here to Iraq and China. So they, they actually did pretty well. I have to admit. Well, the main uh, team they were in the World Qualifiers in the second round in the two. They had. All groups, which group were they? Okay, they were in the group with. Let's just check this group. Group two, I think. Yeah. They were with Australia, Jordan, Kyrgyzstan, Uzbekistan, and Bangladesh. Um, bad draw here against Bangladesh. They won against Kyrgyzstan. Good result, 2-3 also in Jordan away, but also a pretty good result, 3-0 with Australia at home, uh, it's an okay, 2-1 against Bangladesh home, they could have won back more goals, with the friendly against Uzbekistan at 3-0, Uzbekistan clearly a better team here, uh, Jordan 1-2, and then uh, this year 2-3 against Kyrgyzstan, bad result, and they actually did a very tight one here, with 
one, two again. Australia. And they are now in the Asian Cup qualifier group C after a one one friend within Singapore in Afghanistan. And in the group C where they play against Maldives, which they won the first game against. Short one nil victory. Uh, they have much tougher adversaries here, Syria and Thailand. I don't really see them going through this one, but let's see if the, the next game will be in 2017 yeah, and then 2018. <laughs> so they, they, they need a lot of time to do score fires during the par games. Um, on the national team in the main squad, we have until now no player at all. The big star is actually. Damani from Fritz uh, Nepal, the team from the 12th division or 3rd division in Germany. But uh, now let's just go to the game and I need to do the team again. Uh, let's take this guy out. Just make it, we need to do the substitutions here. Um, yeah, you come in. You come in. Yeah, Rava Jog. And the force. I'm an out. So, team selection. Yeah, this is done. So, we're playing with uh, still with three lone players on the starting. Um, 11 lone players have been uh, very important for us to win this battle for the title. Good luck, lads. And I won't make you actually counter because we play away. But I can see if we win this one, we are in the settings, which will be already uh, very good. We'll be the catch then option or we still all or if we are um, if we are lucky we catch the third team. But it will also be from our division most probably. And if we are lucky we can actually go um, to the power rate going to the final. Which would be very good for a team that is looking for the first time in this, uh, this first division. Actually, the first half with absolutely no highlights. Uh, we are dominating slightly. Uh, this is still up with again. I'm gonna go with my semi control mode. Nothing, nobody really that needs to be substituted at the half. Pretty packed stadium actually. At least on the other side, not this one. This one seems to have absolutely no one. Okay, it's having 341 people watching this game. Wow. Pretty really interesting, eh? Okay, it's time to make substitution. This this is probably one of the most boring games ever. Well, it makes all the jobs to win. The 16 year old. And I'm taking Kim and all that. And taking Amanov in. Steering some cheer to Amanov. Let's give this play from your boy. I took out this new package, they seem to, to, to have made some equilibrium on the day. Oh, maybe we have here the first chance. The first highlight comes in the 67th minute. And it's probably for them. For Barty. Oh, fuck. Nice, nice shot actually. And I'm gonna go on the tag team top. Encourage the land. Bit of unfair, this is right here. Let's 
itself is a bar for finally another chance turn this one minute maybe it's the last this time nice pass there I see a lot of crowd here what is the crowd doing They're lot, losing a lot of time, like time wasting. I think I should, should take uh, a goal from midfield, not to do that again. Uh, I'll just close a second. <sighs> I'm going to overload the substitution here. This didn't go as planned. Gonna put here on the action, give more risks in a high tempo. If we, can, if we can actually make something out of this game, still. It's very hit, difficult to recover. I think that the bad thing was losing that tactic, the, the counter attack. Since then, I think we made only one shot. So it was a tactical mistake. And I have here another chance. You know, that's absurd. Can you make it four? Wow. Oh, maybe, uh, I thought this was maybe a chance for us, but no. So another one for them. Definitely was an error here. The first half, or in the, the second half. To change viewers. Yeah, they scored the fourth. I'm gonna go to control. This has been a disastrous for the final I'm glad now that it is over just a few seconds to go no goal should come out of this I feel ashamed after so many good games the one that I showed you was a 4 mil defeat for the biggest defeat I ever suffered with the club until now that's the one I have to show you. So we're out of the cup uh, in the quarters. Gonna be aggressive. I'm not happy with this result. And yeah, that is it. Um, so the next game will actually be um, the last game of the season. That I would uh, try and, or uh, make a video about that would be uh, in nine games time against Iskilal, uh, the last game of the season away. Let's see how we actually face this game. At least until here, then the three last games, most of the two last ones, will be very hard. Now we have here some space to, to head back from what one. Let's see if we can keep the third place in the lead. Okay. So until now, thank you very much for watching and supporting Gecko. I hope you are liking the series. Bye-bye.